how to create pixel art nft collection hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can create your very own nft pixel art collection so let's get started so over here i'm on open seas i'm currently looking at all of the uh you know nfts that are available here and currently there are 31 million nfts and as you can see this one right here this is a pixel art nft this one over here this one is a pixel nft and this one right here this one as well and as you can see this one as well and as you can see there are a lot of nfts over here that are just pixelated so like this one as well like all the nfts are majority of the nfts are i think now more on the side of pixelations than on you know the other drawings like board aid this is like a drawing with the illustrator and the other ones they're like pixels so in this video i'm going to show you how you can do that so let's get started so first things first what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and take a look at over here on pinterest and i'm going to find like a like a image that we can use as a base and then we can you know mold around it and try to you know make one ourselves so as you can see we have a bunch of different ones over here so let's just go ahead and find one that we can easily make so that you guys can understand how to make it so um let's just take this one over here darth vader right this image right here so let me just go ahead and download this image or we can choose another one as well like we have a bunch of different ones and as you can see these are very easy to create there isn't anything too complicated in that so let me just show you so if i just download this image actually before i do that let me just go ahead and view this image over here try to see if it's in a better you know higher resolution yeah it is so this image right here this one is a higher resolution let me just go ahead and download it darth save in the music folder now that we have our image now what we're going to do is we're going to go over to this website called resizeimage.net over here we're just simply going to go ahead and upload the image that we just downloaded which is this one as you can see it's uploaded complete and this is the size 568 by 505 what we're going to do is we're going to lower it down let's just say maybe like 50 percent no not 50 let's say 25 percent all right 142 and 126 and we're going to click on resize image and we're just simply going to download the resized image let's save that over there now what we're going to do is we're going to open up this website called pixelart.com and what I want you guys to do is just simply come over here. Now, pixelart.com is a pretty amazing website where you can create really, really good and really, really amazing looking uh, pixel arts. And then you can convert them into NFTs later on. So this is pretty good. This is really, really good. You don't have to download any fancy tool or, have, you know, need a, quite a lot of skill. Just come online and you can go ahead and start doing it over here. And they even have challenges over here so that if you are someone who doesn't know how to you know begin doing that then you can go ahead and you know complete challenge and start to improve your skill and one day you will become a very good artist of the pixel genre so as i said before we have our drawing let's go ahead and click on start drawing and over here we have the canvas over here we have the canvas setting we need to change the canvas width and length and so we're going to keep it 142 by 126 so we're just going to go with 142 by 126 let me see if it's right 142 126 142 126 yeah that's right so we'll just click on new drawing and boom there we go we have our design over here so right now it's 126 and it's 142 yeah now what we're going to do is we're going to click on file we're going to click on new we're going to click on open image we're going to import the image that we resized so this was the resized image we're just simply going to go ahead and download it and we're going to click on ok boom there we go so this is the image right here now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and start to create one so we're going to add a layer so this is going to be the base layer we will just call this background so that we can have like a white background so we have our canvas ready we have the background ready we'll just click over here so we have it now what, what, what i'm going to do is i'm going to add another layer all right i'm going to rename this one background and the newly added one i'm going to call it outline boom all right now what we're going to do is we're going to create like an outline of it so we're going to choose our pencil tool we're going to increase the size of the pixels in our pencil let's go with six yeah and now we just go ahead and start creating one so we'll go with this one sorry about that we'll go with this one and this one this one over here so it's not actually black it's actually 
gray but we also want to like a black outline as well so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and zoom in over here so over here this is black just going to go ahead and make it like a little nice little outline over here and once i'm done with the outline i will catch you guys in a little bit so i'm just going to simply going to pause the video right here and i will catch you guys in a second once the outline is done all right so as you can see i've done the outline so this is how it looks like it looks pretty nice it looks pretty cool now what we're gonna do is we're gonna map out the colors of it as well so we're gonna have grays and whites and then i'm gonna have like a white background over here as well same goes if i put on the uh you know the background over here the white background this is how it looks like so it'll look much much more cleaner so let's go ahead and do that shall we so for this one i'm just simply gonna let me see the outlines here this is the outlines yep now what i'm going to do is i'm going to add another layer i'm going to call it colored yeah i'm going to click on enter i'm just simply going to click on the color picker tool over here and i'm going to pick this color right here so it's gray all right so now since i've chosen this color over here i'm going to take the pencil tool i'm going to increase the size over here i'm just simply going to paint my painting that's essentially what i'm doing right now let me move this one down real quick so here we go so now that that's up now even as you can see i'm painting but i'm not you know messing around with the uh, outline so even if a little bit color goes outside i know where the outline is and i can just simply remove it so it's pretty nice so let me just go ahead and fill this color out and i will catch you guys in a second and there you go so after coloring it this is how it looks like and personally i think it looks really really good now what we can do is now we just have to simply download the drawing so over here at the top right corner just simply click on save drawing download as pdf slash gif and oh oh i almost forgot before we do you know download it we need to first bring this image back to its original size so we'll click on resize canva and see what was the original size five six eight five oh five we'll go with five six eight five oh five and we'll click on and we'll see resize content as well oh actually no there we go so this is it this is how it looks like but as you can see it's really small so we'll click on we'll control z yeah we'll undo and now we'll just go ahead and resize the canvas 565 502 that was it right 568 505 okay 505 and 568 i was a little off resize the drawing content and we just simply click on resize content boom we have a bigger image now we just simply click on save drawing download this png there we go now we just save it over here pictures and over here i'm just simply gonna say it i'm gonna name it darth i'm gonna click on save there you go file has been saved so now this is how you basically create a png nft and now if you wanted to maybe like have like a different collection what you could do is maybe you can change the background color maybe i like add like a gradient color right so we'll go with a little something like red and for the secondary color we'll go with blue or pinkish type purple no purple i think this looks good so then we just you know select the gradient tool just come over here and over here you just add like a gradient tool a gradient background so something like this then you just download it a bunch of time and that way you have a collection so let me just show you what i mean so as you can see over here i have a bunch of different nfts right so like this one so this is the same nft it has a different background this one was the original one then i have this one this one this one this. see like background changes right and then i have this gif one as well so you can create these types of you know collections with different backgrounds and different colors and then when you've done then you just simply have to go on to open seas and just simply upload your collection and boom that's it so that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye